Good morning, YouTube. This is Waterfall Joe, and welcome to another Waterfall Adventure. Today we're here at Spruce Brook Falls in Naugatuck, Connecticut. And uh, it's raining, it's been raining the past few days. I can already hear the waterfall flowing down there. In my opinion, this is one of the best, you know, bang for your buck waterfalls here in Connecticut. Uh, it's a brook right over here, and there's about five different waterfalls along the, I believe it's at a, about a mile stretch of, of hiking. So. We're gonna head up there. I'm gonna film it for you guys. Maybe get the camera out and show you some pictures. Otherwise, we're just gonna have fun today. Uh, and uh, yeah, if you're here in Connecticut, this is a great one to check off your list. So let's go. One thing to note, if you're like me and you have a, a lowered car, or just a, a lower vehicle, not just a sports car, just any vehicle that isn't high clearance SUV, there's two ways to get to Spruce Brook Falls. One of them is there's a road called Spruce Brook Road. And the other one is a road that runs right next to the train tracks. I can't remember its name. Uh, that road is kind of rough and you might want a vehicle with like four wheel drive or at least high clearance. Uh, for me, I ended up taking the main road over there. It's paved, it's a lot easier to do. Here's the parking lot. Very rough parking lot, of course, not driving down through that at all. But yeah, there's, there's two ways to get to this waterfall. Neither of them are incorrect, but um, just know that if you take Spruce Brook Road, it's a little bit smoother. The only downside to this is we actually have to cross over the brook. Uh, I think we're just gonna walk down here to this road and cross that way, because at the moment, this parking lot actually puts us on the wrong side of the waterfall. So let's head over there and start, uh, let's start checking it out. So if you go to that main parking lot, you'll have to walk along this road right around the train tracks here, and then you'll come to the sign here, Spruce Brook Trail. And now we're good to go. So ever since we got back from Iceland, I really haven't been adventuring much at all. Um, I'm just not a big summer person personally. But today is uh, August 7th and it's been raining like crazy. The temperatures finally dropped. Waterfalls are flowing again. So the good weather brings out Waterfall Joe. All right, we've made it to the first of many waterfalls along this amazing trail. We have a lower section here and then a really nice upper section. We're gonna get there in a second. This is absolutely amazing. I've only been hiking for about five minutes from the parking lot. So this place is absolutely worth your time to come check it out. I'm gonna set up my camera and tripod and I'm gonna take some photos and uh, you guys are just gonna get the chance to watch and enjoy it. So let's set it up. So this right here is probably one of the best waterfalls in Connecticut. This is absolutely breathtaking. To my knowledge, I don't know if it has a name. You know, all of these waterfalls collectively are known as Spruce Brook Falls. This is absolutely breathtaking. It does take a lot of rain to get it look like this. Sometimes it's completely bone dry, but uh, today I'm lucky.
Okay, that one was absolutely incredible, but we still have a few more upstream to go check out. So let's head up there now. Normally there'd be people swimming here. It's a summer day, but luckily it's about 70 degrees. It's been raining, it's cold, it's a Wednesday. I have this place all to myself. If you're ever in Connecticut or you're around the area, come check out Spruce Brook Falls. This place is amazing. Just please pick up your trash and you know the phrase, leave it better than you found it. So be good to this place. I had to take my polarizer off. It was starting to fog up. Hopefully this looks a lot better. But yeah, check this one out. All right, it is humid as all get out out here. I feel like I'm in the Amazon right now. Uh, here's a waterfall in the background. There's also one right down here. I'd say we've passed, this is the fourth one now that we've seen. I think there's still one or two more to go. This is awesome, man. I'd say the first two are probably the best, but hey, it doesn't hurt just to keep going up the trail and seeing what else there is. So we're here at the top of Spruce Brook Falls. Up here it flattens out, but right down here is where it starts working its way down and we get the multiple falls. There's one more waterfall up here. Not good visibility, but we're gonna still go check it out. I'm gonna film it for you just so you can see it. You really can't get too close to it, but it's, uh, it's very grand, it's big, it's beautiful. I'm sure it looks great today. Uh, we're gonna head up there and then head back down toward the parking lot, so. That is scary. Hope I don't encounter any bears today. Back up there is the big one. It's tall, but it's very difficult to get to. So this is as close as we're gonna get but this is the top of Spruce Brook Falls. Uh, after you climb up past all those gorgeous waterfalls, this is the treat waiting for you at the top. So I hope you're able to make it out to this one. It's amazing. Today's a nice rainy day. Uh, it's very humid outside though, but if you can make it here in any season, it's gonna be amazing. Just know that if it's really hot outside, it's probably gonna be pretty dried up. So if you see that rain's gonna be in the forecast, definitely come and check this place out. I'm going to head back to my car, get home and upload this for you guys. And I'd love if you were able to drop a comment, leave a like, hit subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.